And once the snow banks melt, you may find damage on your property. 22 News reporter Alessandra Martinez joins us live after finding out what you need to do if you're in this situation. Those snow banks are hiding a lot of damage caused by city snow plows, and your city or town will help you fix some of those problems on your property. We won't know the full scope of the property problems until the snow banks melt and reveal the damage beneath them. But some residents are already seeing problems. My kids got to walk by there every morning to go to school. So you got like some of the streets cracking. There's cracks on the street, there's cracks on the sidewalk, you know, our driveway, stuff like that. Cities and towns have been working to clear your streets, but snow plows often unintentionally damage your lawn, driveway, mailboxes, and fences. If you do notice that any of your property has been damaged because of a snowplow, you're asked to contact your city's Department of Public Works, report the damage, and they'll help you take it from there. The plows sometimes uh, on streets where there's no curbing. Uh, the first storm, it's hard to determine where the edge of the road is, so they'll rip up some lawn. Uh, same process, you call 311, uh, they'll get the request to us. And uh, we come and we uh, reloam and uh, we'll seed it up. The Springfield DPW also repairs mailboxes and damage where driveways meets city streets. Repairs come out of the DPW supplies budget. DPW Deputy Director Vinnie DeSantis expects more calls concerning property damage this winter since plows have repeatedly gone through neighborhoods over the past eight weeks. The Springfield DPW told 22 News they try and make all repairs within two weeks after the damage is all reported. Live in the studio, Alessandra Martinez, 22 News.